I need to go buy a new bra. Thank you so much for this bra. I think it's like a size four, three, like too big. Uh, that That's very much the reason why I didn't wear it because I was like, yeah, I'm like a 16. This shit fit. Mm. Fun fact, I am not a 16. Yeah, I'm a 16. So. And that was like 16, 18. Yeah. And I'm like a 12, 14. Skinny bitch. I wouldn't say skinny. I don't think I'm skinny. I would say bulimic. <laughs> I twisted that way so it covers my titties. Yeah. I have the X Factor in that everyone I've dated has become my ex. And, um... It's, it's rough, buddy. <laughs> it's rough, buddy. <laughs> Let me... That's the one. That's the one, sis. You are the one, the one, the one, the one Dwayne Dr The Rock Johnson. Dwayne the Jock. Dwayne. <laughs> Dwayne has a big cock, Johnson. <laughs> A Johnson, also known as a cock. Ah! The rock, he's, he's Dwayne the, the cock cock. He's Dwayne <laughs> the rock cock. He's like the rock lobster except <laughs> not good for primary school discos. <laughs> oh! I'm the Shirley B. Right. And I'm the partially deaf. And a welcome to Joe Dragon! So back! <laughs> Today, we're gonna be reacting to RuPaul's Drag Race, Season 16, Episode 16, Grand Finale! Oh my god, it's happening finally! <laughs> it's literally been, what, three, four months since the season started? Well, 16 weeks <laughs> is <laughs> four months. Four months. What, four months? Four months. This season has been going on for like longer than some of my relationships. Jesus Christ. Most. Most. <laughs> I am so excited for mm. this. Now, now, okay. All right, you're excited, but now? I'm excited because. Okay. This may be yeah. one of the closest races <sighs> in drag race history between a top three. Herstory. Herstory. Or them story, okay, not sure. the gender. Or it's story. Anyway, regardless. <laughs> we've got two girls with four wins, mm -hmm. both having been in the bottom before. Yeah. One girl with three wins Never who has not been in the bottom, and that is about as even of a track record you can get between three girls as you can possibly get. Yeah, which just kind of tells me that these were the three girls that A, decided to make it to the end, and that B, none of the other girls had a chance. <laughs> Specifically a mandatory meeting. Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 hey. I mean, you're right. Yeah. Don't call her out like that. <laughs> Great thing about these top three as well is that each has such a defined mm. and polished brand. There is, it, it's just an immaculate conception and presentation of drag from these three people. Come on, Mary. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. Call me Aristotle. No, no, no. Immaculate conception. Oh, Mary. From the oh, Bible. I don't do religions. <laughs> this is general knowledge. <laughs> I'm not a Jesus person. I'm not a, Je <laughs> I'm not a Jesus. <laughs> I hope now we're about to get those performance pieces that we were wanting from that last performance episode. Yes. Um, the last yes. Mexi Challenge main episode. So I'm, I'm excited to see these girls do what they do. I think it's gonna be super exciting. Mm. I love, we all love the finale number. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. Ooh. Mama Roo. Mama who? Mama Roo. I actually love when RuPaul wears like glassware. When she has like big sun, sh like sunglasses and yeah. shades. When she remembers to put in a glass eye. <laughs> oh, 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 okay, transition. Set reveal. This is kind of cute. It's like a tinfoil wrap. <laughs> I love the silhouette. Come on, tinfoil wrap. <laughs> so that's where the rest of my burrito went. <laughs> I didn't know RuPaul was a type of meat. <laughs> RuPaul does look fat though. Mm. To the beat, honey, to the beat. Oh. You get a finger wag from me. <laughs> Must you please validate my target? No, sorry, full fee. Yeah. To celebrate Nymphia wins. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Ah! We challenge each of our three finalists to perform a spectacular original number. I'll choose the top two queens of the season. 
Top two. Oh, how about that? This is kind of OG style. Yeah, it kind of is. I love it. This is like when they had a top three, one girl get eliminated at the finale, and then the top two lip sync. Yeah, literally. And I love it. I'm here for it. Here for it. Okay, bring back the girls. Here we go. Hershey? Oh, oh, that's a, oh, oh, oh no, Hershey. Oh, that's Hershey. Bitch, I saw the blue and I saw the zoom out. Mm. She Look. looks good. Gorgeous. I did think it was Safira for a hot second. Yeah, me too. To Beautiful. <gasps> oh! Mirage. Honey. Mirage, more like marriage. Oh, Because we're getting betrothed after this. She better work. That wig is hot. Oh, oh okay, Amanda. It's kind of campy. That's very, I love it. Campy and vampy. I'm kind of into it. I think it's cute. Yeah. Geneva. Yes, Geneva. Yes, honey. Come on, check your boots. She got a little tie as a handbag. Mm. I love it. Work queen. All right. Oh, okay, girl. Come on, baby. I thought she was wearing sandals for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Would have put it past Megami, Megami, Megambi, <laughs> Namib Namibia yeah. to wear sandals. Oh, oh, come on. The fabric. Art. art. This is art. She looks like a couch. She, she looks like <laughs> the, the couch at your eccentric wine arts place. So my, my house. Yeah, my your house. house, yeah. She's yes. a star. A She's starlet. A She's gorgeous. She looks gorgeous here. She does. She looks Ooh. Yes, tassels. Love Jar the wig. Dripping. That wig. This is everything. stunning. She is dripping in jewels. Damn. Oh my god. Fuck me up. Oh, bitch. What? 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 Oh my god. Incredible. This is beautiful. <gasps> That was interesting. Work. More yeah. Big. My queen. Come on, the body. Yadi, 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 yadi. Come on, baby. Bitch, $50,000 richer, and yep. this is what you get. Oh, oh. come on, Q. Everyone's coming, coming for Safira's gig right now. I, for one, the wig is gorgeous. Yeah, the blue tips. I love the shape of this. Mm. The color is amazing. And now, our top three queens. Oh, Nymphia. Vinyana. Top three. Reveal! Yes! Oh, she is stunning. She looks so good. <gasps> oh. Didn't you already do a look like this on the... Yeah, it was like one of the... It was like the first one where it was the reveal look. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But she's got an aesthetic. Work. Banana. Banana. Fine. Oh. Okay, come on, Teal. You know what's giving? What? It's giving, uh, it's giving Anastasia. Oh, it's, it's giving Russian Princess royalty. Princess Anastasia. Yep. It's Gorgeous. kind of giving it a little bit Dior as well, with oh, just yeah. the dress cut. It's mm -hmm. just the dress cut. Oh, beautiful. I think stunning. Don't hate me for this. I think yeah. she could have gone bigger. She could have. She could have. Speaking oh! of bigger. Oh Bitch. my god. What well, plain Jane lacks in silhouette, Safira more than makes up for. Are you kidding? Greek got it. She's a goddess. She's, look at her. Oh my God. The titties. The titties. She oiled them up. She <laughs> greased them. She got shea oil in one hand, cocoa butter in the other. She said, ha! <laughs> she got herself <laughs> up, bro. The first of our top three performances. Here we go. <gasps> no. Oh my god, look at her. The arrows. No. Oh. Yes, oh, baby! Yeah. Ethereal. We haven't seen her lip sync. No, we haven't. Whoa. Oh, Whoa. shit, so good. Yes, right. baby. Turn it out, turn it out. Oh! Jesus. Oh, my God. She's doing danceography. That is a dancer. That is a dance, sir. Okay, but the song's flat, so. Mm, the song's always do. <gasps> oh wow! Oh. oh my God! What? What? Oh, I just realized they're not in the grand.
grand finale stage. No, they're in the same stage as last week. Nymphia, what you gonna do with all that ass? Ooh! Show it off! All that ass inside them jeans. You know, She's you not wearing jeans. Fuck. Amazing <laughs> this entire season long. But tonight was like the epitome of who Nymphia is as a performer. Always bringing the looks with fashion meets culture, and you did that tonight. Mm -hmm. For the breakaway mm -hmm. into your full pop fantasy, I was here for every single minute of it. She looks so I good. Know. She looks so good. Look at those ostrich feather tufts in this pastel color. Oh my She's lord. She's just literally everything. She is everything. This bitch. Except funny. Wow. <laughs> Look, if there's one thing we've come to expect from Nymphia, it is drag excellence. That's the thing about Nymphia. Every time she shows up and her standard is just excellent. Mm -hmm. I was always a creative child and I just like anything pretty. And drag for me is just a way to express myself and say what I want through fashion. Oh! I have to say, growing up, you will feel like you don't belong anywhere. What a cutie! You've always been. But one day you will come across a woman named Nymphia Wynn. And she is your higher self, so mm. let her guide you throughout your life. And go wherever the wind wants to take you. Oh, oh my god, they came from Taiwan! Damn! This book of the flights. Leo. Oh, her name is Leo. But after he became a drag queen, wow, that's completely different. Mama win. Very emotional to see my <sighs> just being able to represent my country and coming here on the stage and see my parents sit there. My Stop, I am going to cry. How could she be this excellent and not be an ugly crier as well? Fuck her. Oh, fuck her. You know what? After having my pangina robbery and my marina robbery, yes! I'm kind of ready for an Asian winner just to fucking take that crown. Honestly? It would be kind. I would be Team Safira and Plain Jane this whole season, but if Nymphia took that crown from beneath my feet, bitch, I got swept up in the wind. That's all I can say. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's slip into something. Plain Jane's on. <laughs> my winner! Not her song being about body suits. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yeah. Oh! She just knows how to use her eyes. She does. She lights up on stage. She's just. Mm. Her arms, though. <laughs> oh, well, the rest of the body's catching up. <laughs> yeah! She's got a piece of hair stuck in her mouth. I know, I saw that too. Be there for a couple minutes. <laughs> oh. <gasps> a, ma <laughs> a mandatory <laughs> meeting? Is that you? <laughs> She's become what she always hated. <laughs> Come on, step touch. You better step touch. Mm. Throw that hair. All right, yes. She looks so My good. What? Yes, baby! Give it to Bitch. me. Give it to me. Give it to me, yeah. I'm worth it. Bitch, that was hot. Hot, that was, that was hot. hot. Song kind of reminded me. No Noir, caviar. Yeah. Washed up 70s TV, TV star. star. It was given yeah. like that. <laughs> yes! <laughs> There's one thing I would have changed in this number. Oh god. There were like three or four body suits. Mm. God, not so Michelle still giving a critique mm -hmm. to playing Jane on the main stage of the grand finale. All that ass in a body suit. Honey, I don't know how you put all that talent 
in a bodysuit. Oh. Because <gasps> she's just everything. Wow. A little picnic basket. Two bodysuits, actually, Ross. Pitch me the plain Jane marketing campaign for the crown, darling. Okay. okay. RuPaul's saying, make up your one mistake. Um, my campaign for the crown would have to be all this body, Mama Ru. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Her plan for winning is... Uh, <laughs> uh, you're gonna be a track queen when you grow up! <laughs> and, uh, Spoilers! Yeah. ...than I ever have in my entire life. So, mm -hmm. you're gonna get there, baby. Be yourselves. Oh, oh yeah. that was a whole lot of nothing. Self-empowerment, okay? Not everything has to be a drama story. But, that, but I want it to be! <laughs> Yeah. My beautiful mom, and my best <laughs> she's just like uh, the Atlanta airport <laughs> <laughs> and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and my my local constituents. Yeah. <laughs> what do you two have in common? I don't think this is too far apart. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you have the drive and the passion to serve puss. This woman cannot take anything serious yeah. for a second. <laughs> you two can be America's next drag superstar like me. That was, I'm so sorry, that whole thing was Jimbo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're ready for Safira? <laughs> Honey. Oh. Oh. Okay, depending on what we're about to see, I might jump ship to Team Safira by the end of this. Oh my god, here we go! Oh! oh. <laughs> the fabric! <gasps> oh! oh. From this performance style alone and what she's serving, you know what she's giving me? What? Queen Kong. Yeah, Queen, I've said it before. She's uh -huh. giving Queen Kong sometimes. Yes! Yes, okay. baby! Safira is dominating this. She's hitting... Yes! She's hitting all the beats that Nymphia Wynn did with all the face that Plain Jane served. She's just eating them up. She's eating... Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. God, oh my God. Ginger snaps, honey. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Look at all the girls standing up. <laughs> Bitch, and Amanda's dress just broke. Much like the rest of her drag, it was broken it's falling like apart. Yeah! This was the next level Beyonce shit. Oh my lord. Oh, shit. You were dangerous. Number two, the dancing biscuits came out. Ah! Yeah. You, thank you, we baby. Noticed. The look to the opera beginning like all of it is so you. Safira, I'm so oh. excited by you. You should be so damn proud of yourself. Absolutely. And if you are afraid of drag, then you are afraid of freedom. Yes, ma'am. Damn, taking the words right out of the conservatives and spitting it back on them. You get a finger away from me. The evil that's going to come to you, it's really just going to be there to teach you a lesson. And you have parents Aww. who love you, who are going to instill things in you to make you always believe that you are a star. Mm. I feel like she was looking mm. dead in her mum's eyes when she was delivering 100%. that. First time I found out my baby was doing drag was I opened up the closet and it smells kind of rank for no reason. <laughs> no, that's just having a boy child. And didn't take it to the drag queen. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, she mm. Yes, she mother talking is. Yes! Bitch, mother! Mother in the house! Oh. Oh, I was hoping she'd come out as Elvira. But you know what? Oh. 
she's still beautiful. Look at she's her. She's so gorgeous. Look at her. Look at her. She's like stunning. Ten years older than RuPaul. Well, I have to ask, how's your head? Well, haven't had complaints yet. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight what if I said to you, like she almost forgot the yet. She did. <laughs> haven't had any complaints yet. Be true to yourself and try to show as much skin as possible. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you heard it. Take it off. All right. I think I've already just stolen my chicken fillets every three seconds, anyways. All hell, our top three queens. All right. Here we go. But what time has come? Oh. my God. When three must become two. Okay, Sophia is definitely one of them. Yep. I'm scared we're about to lose Plain Jane. Me too. I think, I think, I think, I think it's going to be Sophia and Olympia. I think it might be. Ow. Sophia Uh huh. Yes. She may throw good. Good. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. This is correct. <laughs> Plain Olympia. Plain Olympia. I'm happy with either. Happy with either. Olympia wins. Woohoo! Okay, come through with the undersweep, girl. Oh my god! Damn! Oh, we just lost plain. We just lost plain Jane. You're not, you're not getting your winner, bitch. I'm not getting villain winner. Ain't happening. It just, it's just Safira just ran off, turned yeah. around, and was like, "Oh, I need to hug the girl." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, "Oop." But you know what? If we're not getting the villain winner this time, that means I can be the villain winner. Well, <laughs> you have to win first. <laughs> I also have to be a villain. What? $25,000 tip. Yes, <laughs> Jolish. Direct to Venmo. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Do you have anything to say? Um, well, I, I'm a little unprepared. I thought I was going to be moving on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Drag delusion. Love yourself, eat yourself, and smell my greasy, stinky burger finger. <laughs> oh, she's so fucking just weird. Uh, but she's oh, coming back for all stars. Is that Sasha Colby? Wait, what? That was Sasha oh. Colby. Oh, she's gonna hand over the crown. We get oh. Sasha Colby again. I didn't see it, so we're about to witness her look. Me for the first time. Sasha Colby, take a look. Oh, 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 Sasha, oh, Sasha. Oh. 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 Period. Catch that and check it in. Oh. I'm so glad we got to see her live. Transformative experience. Oh, literally. Transformative? Yes. In fact, it was a formative experience for my trans identity. <laughs> and I realized I was transphobic. <laughs> kidding! I am kidding! I am kidding! Stop typing! <gasps> we get a oh. performance. Yes. Oh, she looks incredible. I know. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! She doesn't need to do anything, she just needs to walk. And she owns the stage. This was the year to be in the grand finale stage. Yes. I love how they're like, you know what, Sasha, just do a whole number. Yeah, just and they're like, number. no dancers, you're the focal point. Yeah. Just you, Boo. Oh. 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 And so in lesbian with her. Oh. Yes! yes! <laughs> Honey, welcome to the Jizz Arena. Oh. Yes, the oh Jizz Arena! Oh my real. god. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a goddess. Oh, oh my god. The headpiece, the way it's sparkling. Girl, her headpiece covers her titties. Bitch, these are her earrings. No one has ever done drag before. <laughs> This is the first <laughs> recorded instance of drag in our history. Trailblazer Award this year for mm. bringing the Mahu and Kanaka Maoli to life here on a global stage thanks to you. Wow! Mm. Now, Sasha, I have a personal question to ask. Do you have anything to plug? Where's Bruno? Sephira's season. This is what this feels like. White. Oh, then oh. next is red. Oh, next, next is, is red. red. American, yep. Oh, cute. Uh, 
Q looks so good. Oh my god. Damn. Come on, Red. Hey, I love Dawn. Dawn looks beautiful. Dawn's outfit. I'm obsessed. Oh! I'm obsessed. I love that. That, that silhouette is so cute. Yes. yes. They all look so beautiful. Mm -hmm. She's a bald eagle. Oh, She's a bald eagle. I just got it. She's a bald eagle. Mm. I am thrilled to announce this year's winner. Long may she spread kindness. The winner of Miss Congeniality. Mummy and. and I don't even know who else. Best winner. Tsunami yet? Yes! Cold a bitch. From the Come day. On, baby. From the day she left the competition, I said, Miss Congeniality, she... I doth betroth. Not betroth. I will betroth thee, beseech that not beseech, stop, bequeath thee. <laughs> yes. Fan favorite. Yes, fan favorite. <laughs> second winner, second winner. Oh! Wait, what? We had, we Can have she a win winner that? congeniality. Holy shit! Wait, what? I mean, it really was the right choice. It was, 100%. They were, like, they were like, ever, you know what it was? Mm. Everyone probably voted for Safira. Mm. And then the tsunami was the second vote. Yeah. I present to you, Nymphia Wynn and Safira Crystal. Yes! Mm. Oh, oh my god, look at mm. them. She's literally a bubble tea. She's the bubble tea pope. She's hoping and poping, girl. <laughs> Queen, I don't think I'm ready for this. I don't think this. I'm ready for this. Two queens stand before me. Oh. Prior to tonight, you were asked to prepare a lip of what? Of what? Of Madame Madame. <laughs> <laughs> yes! I have been waiting for this song. Aussie diva, represent for down under. Oh my god. I think I reckon because Kylie Minogue is probably the second most famous person under myself in Australia. <laughs> So okay, oh my god. I don't I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this at all in the sliders. I'm now we've seen Safira Cristal lip sync like six times at this point. Yeah. Mouth trembles, eye movement, she's great. Mm -hmm. I'm ready to see what Nivia does. Same. <laughs> Underneath, it was like she was emerging from I fog know. or something, bitch. From the dark. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> she did a costume reveal in a fucking she did a car, car wheel. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh my god. Oh, are you shitting me? Holy shit! Ah, <laughs> sugar them titties. Sugar them titties. Sugar them titties. Come on, Jada Sophia. The Nymphia is killing this. This is not how I saw this finale going. Me neither, not at all. But I'm so fine with it. Yes, come on, girl, oh, give wow. us it. Yes, high kicks. Kick. Kick. High kicks, high kicks. This is how we do it. Yeah, yes. yes. Ass out for the team. Oh! oh! It literally looked like Nivia just bashed her face in the stage. <laughs> it's a good thing that Nivia never ended up in the bottom because she would have sent every single person home. Every single bitch. Single. She's still there showing up. See, what she's doing right now is kind of what I expected from Mirage during the Lip Sync Lala Perusa Smackdown for the crown. Yeah. But Mirage seemed like she was just very in her, in her head about it. Mmm. Nivia was free. Sold. Yeah. She was free. She was having fun with it. The winner of RuPaul's Drag Race will receive Holy a crown shit. and scepter provided by Fierce Drag Jewels. Holy shit. A year supply of Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics. I think Nivia Wynn just Sasha Velour. Bitch, she might, have, she might have just done that. The time has come. 
to crown our queen. <laughs> Ladies, <laughs> I'm not ready. I've made my decision. Roll the dice. Yeah. The winner. Roll the dice. Oh my god. Shake the rice. It's Santino Rice. America's next drag superstar is. Oh my god. God, the undersweep of the <laughs> century. <laughs> I am gapped. I am I'm gapped, gated, glazed. Yeah. <laughs> Just remember to live fearlessly and have courage to live your truth. And Taiwan, this is for you. Yeah! Yes! We've got our Asian winner. Oh my God, this is the first Asian winner since Raja. Since Raja. Russia. Work queen. Oh my, oh my god. Lord. This is not what I thought was going to happen. Am I mad? Hell no. Oh my god. She's my, so my brain hot. is like rebooting right now. Does that mean now everyone's expected to look as good as Nivea Wind every time? Because I'm not auditioning if that's the case. Uh, <laughs> no, we all just have to wear yellow. <laughs> yes, look at her go. Come on. Oh, that's Sasha Velour oh, ponytail. Oh, Sephira. Sasha Colby, sorry. Ah. Holy shit. Oh my shit. god. I don't know Are you sure you means. don't watch Love Triangle UK? Holy shit. <laughs> Gag, grouped, ganded, gaping. Glazed. Glazed. Honestly. Like a Saturday night. <laughs> Bukaki! Bukaki! <laughs> Where's I... Geneva Car? I lost my Bukakis! <laughs> Get out of my fucking sorry, castle! Sorry, I'll leave, I'll leave! I am. I am. I, I am. <laughs> not to hijack, but you gave a moment of silence there, so. I am shocked mm -hmm. to my core. Uh huh. Nivia? was my third place. That is not to say she does not embody Drag Race excellence because she does. Mm -hmm, but just considering all like the comedy acting challenges in this season and the way that they were kind of setting up a Safira plain Jane top two. Mm -hmm. And then for Nivea just to side sweep the both of them and say, you know what, actually I'm better than you both. So all this is <laughs> telling me is that her, like, one of her strongest suits was lip syncing. Yeah. And that is just something we never got to see her do. Yeah. Apart from, like, the girl group challenge and, like, the rusical kind of. But that's but not, like, like, I mean, that's, yeah, that's lip syncing, but you're mm. also, like, in a character, you have yes. choreography There's to follow. There's confines. Whereas yeah. Nymphia shows up best when she's allowed to have her full mm. artistic integrity and creative freedom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I'm like, that is the most, like, Flip flop, upside down, mm -hmm. reverse cowgirl type of shit. <laughs> and you know spread what? Spread eagle number spread seventeen. Number seventeen, the spread eagle. Mm -hmm. But I am so happy. <laughs> I'm. I am. I have so much love. The thing is, okay. So I tend to root for the artistic Asian queens because there is a, an amalgamation of both like that creative freedom as well as just mm -hmm. like a, the cultural connotations that get carried i was team neo hudu x and dragula season five i was team hosto teratoma and dragula season four i was team raja i was team van von odd i was team marina summers and pangina heels bitch this time round, i because I was following plain Jane Safira's journey, mm -hmm. maybe I didn't give enough credence to her journey in this season, but for her to get the comeuppance that she did has just given like a bow tie resolution on like everything that I've experienced with my want for Asian winners in all these seasons across all these lands. And I'm so proud of that bitch for doing what I, she did. Oh, I am so proud of her because she came in uh -huh. as I would say the underdog in the finale. Yes, yeah. And she literally, her number was perfect. Yeah. It was beautiful. She looked beautiful. The song was good. The mm -hmm. choreography was great. She was doing lifts and shit. Uh -huh. Work. My, my favourite thing about her performance 
the balloon reveal. Oh my god. For me, there was... Or immediately what I saw was like the black spots on a banana mm-hmm. coming off as if she was like de-ripening. As if she yeah. was saying, you know what? I'm fresh again. Yeah. Like, here we go. But also black balloons are a symbol for depression. Oh. So like her journey throughout this competition being that de- the depressive, anxious like episodes from having that cultural connotation of like not being beautiful to white standards, not mm. fitting into white standards. And that just felt like her shedding mm. all of those those things that were bogging her down mm. and just rising above it. And bitch, I was gagged. Also balloons. Yeah. yeah. I am just like, <laughs> I love Plain Jane. Plain Jane's number mm. was gorgeous. Uh-huh, it was her a lot was, of fun. Hers was fun. Safira's number, I think, was my favorite. It was my favorite. Safira was my favorite in the mm. number category. Yeah, she was great. I love mm. what she was. She was just there the whole time, and she just killed it every single second. Mm-hmm. But I think just because we expect Safira to kill it every yeah. single second, we did not see Nymphia coming out with that. Yeah. And I think that is what kind of gave her the edge uh-huh. because we didn't see it coming. Now I thought it was going to be kind of like similar to like a Jinx Monsoon situation, or like kind of most seasons when you look into it. Where that final lip sync mm. wasn't going to be taken as much into account against the person's track record throughout the season. Oh yeah. So I thought oh, they yeah. were setting up a Safira win. She did mm-hmm. the great number. Yeah. Maybe she didn't perform as well as Nymphia, but she performed incredible number. Incredibly nonetheless. well. So I thought they were going to crown her. Mm. Um, I, I had a point as to why I was going on this tangent. Mm-hmm. Um. And you know what? They didn't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's the end of my sentiment. That's fair. Yeah. That's fair. Um, oh, oh, that's just what I was going to say. I was, what I was thinking was they were going to crown Safira because Safira has been auditioning for 11 years. Mm-hmm. She showcased everything she had to offer this season. And I thought that the other two had a better opportunity at coming back to an All Stars. I would agree. And like showing an even more immaculate package mm-hmm. than they had prepared this time round. Yeah. Whereas Safira, I feel like, had kind of shown all that Safira shows. Yeah. You know, and not to say that she doesn't have more evolution to come, but like she's at the top of her game. She's she's at the top of her game. Whereas yeah. like both Plain Jane and Nymphia, mm-hmm. I can kind of see. Okay, there are some things that. Can, can grow a little bit. There is yeah. an evolution there to have. Mm-hmm. But Safira is like end game. Yes. Boss level shit. Yeah. But so I, w- I was surprised, but also I'm just so fucking happy for Ms. Nymphia win. Me too. I loved seeing all the other queens come back. Mm-hmm. They all looked beautiful in mm-hmm. all of their looks. I yeah. was not disappointed in the slightest. Uh-huh. I loved the shady cuts to Amanda. <laughs> that was brilliant. Loved it. Just the... And that's all. Gorgeous. That's all, folks. Uh, and also, Sasha Colby. Sasha Colby. Oh! And... Queen and Queens. I mean, obviously, yeah. Let's talk about Sasha Colby for another five seconds. Oh my god, she's beautiful. Oh my god, she's excellent. She's everything. Oh my god, she's a, a, a drag. Period. Period. Um, But, not to hijack Sasha's moment, but someone else who showed up and showed out almost unexpectedly when you compare, you know, her run from last season... Malaysia, baby doll, baby doll, oh, baby doll, fox. Oh my god, Malaysia's look was impeccable. Impeccable. Anthropomorphic bitch. I think this is a season for the books. Yeah. Overall, this is such a fun season. It had great mm-hmm. drama. Yeah. Great queens, great challenges. Mm-hmm. I'm sad we didn't get like a top four RuPaul number. Yeah. But it is what it is at this point. Would we watch? I would put this top ten for me. Yeah. I would say it's a good top ten. Because this is just a yeah. fun, it's a fun, like, like nine season. Or yeah, 9 or 10. <laughs> but it's like, it's a good, fun season. Yes. And it was, like, enjoyable to watch. The outcome was good. Mm-hmm. I, it was just joy and happiness and bitchiness yeah. and plain Jane being a cunt. <laughs> um, yeah. Which is joy for me. So that's yeah. why. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming and joining us for the final episode of season 16. Uh, don't forget to tune in for the next episode of, uh, which one are we doing now? Spoilers! And thank you for joining us for another season. And also do not forget to like, comment, and also subscribe. And click the notification bell because there's so much more content to come out. We're probably going to start thinking about
about venturing away from the reaction series is, 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 is. Possibly. I mean, alongside. Alongside. alongside yeah. So, um, get ready for all the content we chuck out there. I'm the Shilla B. Rye. And I'm the Portially Death. Nymphia! Nymphia! Slay. <laughs> you did it, girl. You got a big <laughs> wag from me! me. <laughs>